Time for recess. And just where do you kids think you're going? Recess, Miss Finster. Recess? Oh, how sad. How sweetly heartbreakingly naive. Recess has been canceled. Canceled? But why? Rain. Man, indoor recess, the worst. Actually, having recess inside once in a while isn't so bad. It offers a chance to get ahead on homework, plan the next day's reading list, perhaps even evaluate an experiment or two. You're a wild one, Grundler. <gasps> okay, listen up, you little hooligans. We're all going to be indoors for the duration of this storm, so you better get used to it. While inside, there are several rules you will abide by. There will be no running, jumping, climbing, whistling, throwing, catching, frolicking, skipping, singing, somersaulting, sliding, tackling, <gasps> juggling, arc welding, interpretive dancing, experimental filmmaking, or having any fun of any kind. In fact, if you can think of it, you probably can't do it. You may, however, play quietly. This box here is filled with games and puzzles for your amusement. <coughs> Finster, my dad played these games. Yeah, these puzzles are ancient. Half the pieces are missing. Yeah. yeah. Quiet! Now, if none of that suits you, Randall here has kindly volunteered to offer another form of entertainment. Show him, boy. Bingo, anyone? Bingo puzzles? Oh, man, this is going to be a boring recess. At least it's just for one day. Yeah, can't last forever. That's just what they want you to think. Butch, that you? You're looking nervous, man. Nervous? Sure, I'm nervous. And you should be, too. What do you mean? Look at you kids just sitting there thinking, Hey, this rain will end. Tomorrow's going to be a sunny day. Well, that's just what my brother Joey thought during the storm of 89. A storm so big, kids were stuck inside for five days. Five days? Yeah, and Joey barely lived to tell the tale. What happened? Nothing at first. But by day three, guys started to crack. Kids began getting on each other's nerves. Friends became enemies. By day four, cabin fever set in. Guys started muttering to themselves, laughing at jokes no one ever told, kicking balls that weren't there. And by day five, I, I can't say it. We gotta know, Butch. On day five, they started vegging out. Too weak to talk or play or even think. They became the famous zombie class of 89. They just lay there. They were helpless. They were defenseless. They were mine. <laughs> Do you think all that stuff Butch said was true? A storm that lasts five days? Get real. Yeah, trust me, Gus. If this rain isn't over by recess tomorrow, I'll play bingo. That does it. I'm out of here. So Brittany said, nah, uh and Lindsay said, uh-huh. So I said, like, I am so sure. What you doing, Vince? I can send my cake. Nice follow through. Got a head for this guy. Nope, but the goat's head from this puzzle might fit. <laughs> You're right. Fits great. Hey, you guys, you want to hear my poem? Sure. <clears throat> The farmer's horse was reining up, the rain was raining down, the king was reining over all the country and the town. They rained and rained and rained together, and that was surely April weather. So what do you think? I think if I don't get out of here soon, I'm gonna snap. Come on, guys. It's rained two days already. It can't get any worse than this. And three. Does anyone have and three? I think I'm getting something. Clearing up tonight to count on sunny skies for the rest of the week. Yay! This is Kate and Chef, WCOW, Bombay, India. Bombay, India? We're never getting out of here. <laughs> Two more days and they're going to crack like cheap linoleum. Mud, mud, oh glorious mud. How does thee come to be thee? By rains of the mud in a glorious vein. Hee hee, hee hee, hee hee hee. Mud, mud, oh glorious mud. Will you stop? I was just trying to kill time. Well, you killed it. It's dead and buried. So take it somewhere else, you big lummox. Now, Spinelli, there's no reason to... Will you stop flinging your infernal leg? What? I'm practicing. There's a time and place for everything, and this is neither. At least I'm not wasting all my time with that stupid cue. Well, you're not stupid. Don't you see what's happening? 
It's just like Butch said, day three and we're all at each other's throats. But we're bigger than that, guys. All we have to do is stick together. Besides, the rain's got to be over by tomorrow. It's just got to. Tell me about the sun, TJ. I can't remember the sun. <gasps> Did you see that? Yeah, and look. That's unusual. That's nothing. Check this out. Thank goodness. Oh, it was all just a bad dream. Hey, could that mean... Water, water everywhere, and not a drop to drink. Well, we can just stop here. It looks like it's just about time for... Miss Gokey, please don't make us dull. We'll do anything! A test, a report, anything! It's great to see you all so high on your studies, but I'm afraid we're all done with our lessons. You'll just have to go to recess. Ah! Don't say that word! Maybe we can clean the blackboard? But Gretchen's cleaned it twice already. Third time's a charm! Class dismissed. G4. That's G... Ugh. Bingo! Oh, what's the point? Whatever, whatever, whatever. That's it! I can't take it anymore! I get a jump! I swear I get a jump! No, don't do it! Somebody help him! That's it! I'm jumping! Oh, the humanity! I don't know how much more of this I can take, you guys. I've already done all my homework through the 11th grade. If I don't get outside soon, I'm gonna kill somebody. Psst. Hey, check it out. Stuff from the outside. A leaf. I remember those. How much you want for it? Five bucks. Two fifty for the step. But, but I only got a dollar thirty-four. Sorry, I got a lot of other customers. Maybe next time. No, no, no! Totally sapped of energy. Can't move. Must stay awake. Must. Ugh. Now, this is what I call a recess, huh, kids? Where are your high spirits now? Your rambunctious, troublemaking ways. <laughs> it's just like back in 89. How I love it. Ah, now, let's see. Oh, creative detention. Hmm. Water? Hey, it's just water. What are you doing, TJ? What I should have done a long time ago. Hey, what's happening? I'm going outside. You can't do that, man. Oh, yeah? Well, why not? All these years, they've been making us stay in one place or another. When we were small, they made us stay in the playpen. When we were a little older, they made us stay on the mat. And now they're making us stay in here. Well, I say why. Uh, because it's raining? Guys, it's just water. You go swimming in it, don't you? You take baths in it, don't you? It's just water. And I, for one, I'm not going to let a little water ruin my recess. Now, who's with me? I'm in. I'm in. Where was you, TJ? How about the rest of you? Gee, I don't know, TJ. Yeah, we could get in a lot of trouble. Well, if you change your minds, you know where to find us. They're crazy. Or are we the crazy ones? It's puddle time. <gasps> they made it! They really made it! Oh, support holes, 20% off. Oh, no. <laughs> you kids get back in here right this minute! Sorry, Miss Finster, but we're finally enjoying our recess. As nature intended. But but you can't do this! You'll catch a cold! You'll poke your eye out! <gasps> no, it can't be! I was so close! They were almost mine! Man, you guys really did it! You played in the rain! What was it like? It was the greatest, guys. It was like a recess for the ages. Wow! Well, guys, that was pretty cool. Yeah, I'm filthy, but I wouldn't trade it for the world. We won, you guys, and nothing will ever keep us from recess again. <laughs> Come on, let's go inside. <clears throat> Man, my head is killing me. Do I feel warm? Oh, anybody got a tissue? <laughs>